It was what that's what the matter to lead today is. Thursday, Thursday, my city, Chicago, February the 29th, last day of Black History Month, 2024. Look, I made a uh, rap version to the Hail Melvin and Blue Note song, uh, Wake Up Everybody. I call it Wake Up Call to All. I put it on cassette tape back in 1995. Oprah Winfrey got a hold to it, and the streets got a hold to it, and as a result, they put me on the psych ward, but everybody else was making money off of it. I got railroaded May 31st, 2008 for so-called disarming the police officer, something I did not do on the bond clock in my city of Chicago. Uh, I was on a so-called parole violation and stuff, and they had me in the white uh, women prison and common. Y'all know common sense. He came up with the version, you know, rap version also, and they was mocking me while I was in prison. You understand what I'm saying? So I'm looking at Common Sense, dude, the rap version that I originally came up with first to the Hell Melvin and Blue Notes song, Wake Up Everybody. But like I said, I call it Wake Up Call to All. I've been in this trap building since 210 South Kimbark Avenue, Chicago, North 60637. When I first got here, I um, also did it and put it online and stuff you know but people act like they don't know what time it is and stuff everybody has done that version but the original is still out there on cassette tape and somebody's trying to hold on to it hope it not die uh the common sense mother is a teacher he's also from chicago and was you know in the surrounding areas of uh, 87th street where i used to sell cassette tapes and CDs and music, movies and things of that nature or whatever and stuff. I'm a child abuse victim, grew up, you understand what I'm saying? Beat the system, beat the streets, beat the government, beat everybody and stuff. But people still try to act like they don't know what time is. My face should be plastered everywhere just because I'm still alive. You understand what I'm saying? And I say the lot of lies and if I die, you die. Everybody, you understand what I'm saying? Till you stand up for yourselves. This story is uh, a continuous you know, uphill and downhill battle, I guess. I don't know. All y'all had to do was stand up, real talk. Um, he also did a um, video, a song with Maya Angelou. And you know, Maya Angelou is connected to Oprah Winfrey. So nothing happens in this world by mistake, real talk. So common sense ain't common no more, I guess, when it comes to real people, people who supposed to be smart. Let's see what the Bible says. It says Second Kings chapter twelve, verse seven. Right here, I wrote. Uh, what's this? What did I write? I can't even see my own right writing. Look like it say rappers though, right here. You understand what I'm saying? And gave me no respect. So we're gonna do twelve, thirteen, fourteen, and fifteen. Let's see what this page say over here. Uh, uh, let's go all the way to, um, 17, because it's got Oprah's name right there, and I gave her my child abuse rap at the age of 17 in 1984. This is, uh, 2 Kings chapter 17, and, um, it's got Do or Die. You know, Do or Die was a rap group. They won an Oscar for Hustle and Flow, but I can't win one for, uh, Wake Up Call. To all, I wake up everybody, and I'm still number one. Common sense. You hear me? Stop mocking me. Stop stealing my stuff. Rappers, if you don't stand up for me this time, I guarantee you, all here will break loose. And with that, it's your good news for that. Soon and merrily, step your game up. Peace.